Hey guys, uh, this is going to be my first video log. Uh, I've had a new YouTube channel. Uh, so I'm probably going to be posting on that. It's going to be a bunch of random things. Uh, whether it's, you know, like a motivational thing. Whether it's, you know, just kind of tips on maybe some random stuff. Just things I've thought about for the day. Uh, some funniest, some maybe a little serious. So, uh, yeah, definitely check it out. Uh, this video was probably posted on Facebook. Um, and I'll probably add my video, I'll probably add my link on here to my YouTube page. So, it's all, it, I'm going to try to do one once a week. Uh, they will most likely be up by Friday. So probably about every Friday I'll have something posted, um, if not more for the week, depending on the, how the week goes, what's going on. So uh, let's just get started. So it is raining. I am driving from Terre Haute to Evansville, Indiana. Um, I just dropped off my daughter. Uh, so it's very entertaining. Uh, it's a very boring trip. That's why I've decided to do this. <laughs> um, I will start off with a joke. So, little Timmy is sitting on a curb. Eats a skittle, takes a bite out of a cat, moves down the curb. Does it again. Takes a bite. Eats a skittle, takes a bite out of a cat, moves down the curb. This happens about three or four more times. Finally, the neighbor comes out and he's like, Timmy, what the hell are you doing? He's like, I'm training to be a truck driver. I'm, I'm popping pills, eating pussy, and moving down the road. There's a little joke for you. Pass it on. If you don't get it, I'm sorry. It's entertaining. I get it because I've been a truck driver. So, there's a joke. Uh, I'm new at this, obviously, so I'm not really sure what to talk about. Um... Oh, here's something to talk about. Yesterday, I found out that, yes, for right now, marijuana is legal in the city, Indiana, strictly for medicinal purposes. Well, that is going to change as January 1st, 2015. It's going to be legal all across the board. You're going to be able to do exactly what California, Colorado, Ohio or any other state that marijuana is legal, they get to do. Meaning, you're going to be able to go to a store, buy a couple grams of marijuana, and legally smoke it. Now, I don't have a problem with this. This is whatever. I've smoked weed. I, will, I, I won't deny that. I've been clean, though. I've been clean for a, five years now. Five, six years now. Um... I'm in the military, so I can't. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, I find it very entertaining. Indiana is a very Republican state. For them to federally pass a legalization of marijuana is entertaining, honestly. Um, just uh, Wednesday, I believe, Mar uh, gay marriage is legal in this state of Indiana. You know, it, it just kind of it shocks me how much how much our world, you know, especially in the United States, is changing, especially over the past 20 years. 20 years ago, it would never would have been dreamed about that the United States would allow gay marriage. It was a very taboo topic. Uh, homosexuality was a very uh, it was very taboo. Nobody talked about it. Um, and when we did talk about it, a lot of people talked down on it. It's just like slavery. You know, I mean, okay, 50, 70 years from now, or before now, you would okay, you were to look at somebody that said, and then tell them, and it's to, uh, whenever Obama got elected, in 2010 or whatever, that Obama was going to get elected, being a, a mixed African-American president, be our first mixed president. If you were to tell them that, oh my gosh, it would have been the end of the world. 
honestly, I it just it just never would have happened. Just like okay, like right now. Let me throw an example about right now. Hillary Clinton is once again talking about running for president. This is a touchy feely situation. Um, my opinion, and a lot of other Americans' opinions, is. When Bill Clinton was in office, Hillary Clinton ran the office. Okay, if she did, she did. Well, she's running, for, trying to run for presidency again. I have nothing against women. I am not sexist. I may make my jokes every once in a while. But, I, I don't see anything wrong with Hillary Clinton becoming president. Just like I didn't see anything wrong with, Bill, uh, with Barack Obama coming into office. I've got different views now, but we are never going to be able to understand if she's going to be capable of doing it. We need to stop bashing her and just let it happen. If she becomes president, she becomes president. Congratulations, Hillary Clinton. You're the first president of the United States, the first female president of the United States. Okay? What, you know, what, what everyone say to George Washington, everyone was skeptical about having a quote-unquote president. Because they thought it was a kink. Well, that's touchy Philly too. So, give it a chance. The United States has morphed, it's changed, it's evolved throughout the years. We're never gonna, you know, know unless we give it a try. So, I apologize for getting into politics. But, I mean, it, it just seems like people need to be awoken. Everyone's a Democrat. Or anyone, or, you know, you're either a Democrat or you're a Republican. Me, I'm in between. I've got my point of views. If I don't like your point of views, I don't like you. Not necessarily don't like you, but there's a higher chance, politically, I'm not going to vote for you. But... I don't, I don't have the same views as Republicans, but I also don't have the same views as a, as a Democrat. I'm in between. I don't like voting simply because I don't like to pick a side. But I will. I vote when I can. When it comes election time, I vote. Because it's my rights. It's my ability as an American. If you don't vote, don't let anyone force you to vote. But exercise your rights as an American. Do what you got to do to help the president. But if you don't vote, don't bitch. Don't talk politics. Don't talk bad on the president. Because you didn't vote. That's my point of view. Now, I'm done. I've spent eight and a half minutes doing a video. Um, so, I apologize if I've offended anyone. If that's typically how this stuff is going to go. Uh, it's just going to be my point of view on the digital videos. So, not all of them. But every once in a while, I, you know, I'll get a little touchy-feely for some people. So, that is my video. I hope you guys at least liked it. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.